Jeremy session says an inch of rain a week is typical, but in the last couple of weeks alone, they've already seen up to 20 inches. Struggling to get things growing over the past couple of weeks. It's just been cloudy and nasty across the Gulf Coast. Farmers can't seem to catch a break rough on the plants. It's been beating them up. Relentless rain and wind hitting South Alabama almost as soon as spring crops hit the soil. At Sessions Farm, tomatoes, cucumbers, watermelon, and cantaloupe now plotted in pools of water. Probably in a neighborhood of 15 to 20 inches of rain. Jeremy Sessions says it's been years since they've run into so much rain so early on in the season, telling me if Mother Nature doesn't let up soon, they may have to start from the ground up again. Have some replanting issues, which could set them back anywhere from a week to 10 days. Just because of the two weeks worth of, of bad weather and rainy conditions, we depend on being early so that we can capture the early, early market and get better prices for our product. Sessions still holding out hope that things will shape up. Mother Nature has a way of correcting itself, so if we get some pretty weather in here, I think we're going to be in, in line for a good uh, quality product. Now, if farmers can't make up for lost ground, Session says the price of produce could be affected come summer. Live in Mobile, Morella Porter, Fox 10 News.